What's up y'all? Welcome back to another video. Basically back in December, my mom and my stepdad decided to officially get married in Key West. They wanted to do a cruise with their closest friends and family. So they chose a five day, four night cruise out of Miami to Key West to Cozumel and then back to Miami through Celebrity Cruise Line. This vlog takes you along our five days together as well as a little bit of the wedding ceremony itself. I got to be my mom's maid of honor and it just overall was a really special experience. So I'm glad I got to document it for you guys. All right, let's get into the video. Okay, hi everybody. Welcome back to another one of my videos. Today I am on a ship, but I'm on a different ship than usual. If you guys have been subscribed, you know I just went on semester at sea. I got home about six days ago, so not even for a week, and I'm already back on another ship because my parents are actually getting married. This cruise goes from Miami to Key West to Cozumel. Back to Miami, it's five days, four nights, and my parents are getting married tomorrow on the beach of Key West in the morning. This is definitely a long time coming. My stepdad has been with my mom for the past like 10 years and they've been engaged for I think around seven so they finally are making it official even though they've basically been married for the past 10 years and I'm really excited to watch it happen tomorrow I'm actually the maid of honor for my mom which is really exciting but we just got on the cruise we haven't looked around the cruise at all yet we just got to our stateroom I'm here with Jay my boyfriend <laughs> yeah honestly I have not done much planning for this trip we pulled up to the terminal and they were like you're going to silhouette right and I was like uh yeah i didn't even know the name of the ship we were getting on i usually am more prepared for trips but we're just gonna send it and enjoy ourselves also my family is gonna be on the ship it's a small wedding it's like 20 people but like my grandparents and my brothers are here and a lot of my mom's cousins are here so it'll definitely be a nice reunion for everybody and i was going back and forth on vlogging just because i have been vlogging like pretty much every day for the past four months but this is a really cool experience to say that you have seen your parents get married and been in their wedding so thought I'd take you along. We're probably gonna go explore the ship in a little bit. I guess I'll show you the room. It's so nice, so much bigger than the cabin I had for Sass. I'm kind of freaking out right now. It's probably like double the size. The beds are separate right now. Or no, you push them together. Yeah. <laughs> it's like two twin beds. We came in and our steward was fixing the room, but he said he's gonna like set it up to be together you should show when we get back. Um, the vents on here. Oh yeah, they have like a whole itinerary for, is this just day one? I have no idea. I think it is. That's crazy. Look, Just they have a for one day. disco. So it's around two right now. We were looking at there's like a chance to win a Rolex and then there's a complimentary liquor tasting, which is really cool. Probably go to that. And then we also got where is that card that says when we're eating? Here we go. This card also came in the little folder we got when we came in. It just says like when we eat, we eat at 5.45 at table 267 at the Grand Cuvée. We should go find that. There's a full on couch, crazy. Got a big window with a nice view of the back of the ship. I think this is the helicopter landing pad, which is really cool. You can see Miami from here and the flags. We got to Miami yesterday and we just spent one night here. And then a little vanity, TV, more storage. There's so much storage in here. Some over the bed. Nice closet, robes that we're very excited about, and then bathroom, which is really nice. Yes, I'm very excited. This should definitely be a really fun trip. There's a wristband on my arm right now because the hotel we stayed at had like wristbands to go to the beach. We went there for a little bit this morning after we got breakfast, and then we just took an Uber over here, and it's about two. But yeah, welcome to another vlog. Okay, we just made it to the movie theater. It's so weird because this ship is... Like it has very similar things to the ship I lived on, but they just look so different. Like the Kino, I had a class in on Sass, and it was probably like fourth the size of this. This is really nice. I and mean, it even has lights. We did not have that. I think they're showing the minions tonight. <laughs> there's like a bar in here that looks so cool. And there's a Wii, which is sick. Oh, is there board games? Yeah. Okay, now this is something similar. I think there's like a slot tournament tonight that's complimentary. This is huge. Found the indoor pool. The gym is ginormous, guys. There's so many treadmills. Oh, it keeps going. What even is this? <laughs> I have no idea. Some type of app thing, probably. Oh, they have Pelotons. Oh my God. Okay, good morning, everybody. It is the 
wedding day. My mom and I are actually getting our hair done on the ship at the spa. So I'm walking there right now. It's about 7 a.m. The wedding is at 10 and we're gonna be leaving around 9. And we are in Key West. That is our first port on the cruise. That's where my parents are getting married. Probably gonna try and grab coffee before I go to the spa so i need to figure out where that is this ship is so huge there's 16 floors and the last ship i was on had nine okay i do not know where to go i'm assuming 14 would have it so we're just gonna go there and hope for the best so once my mom and i were all finished getting ready we drove over to the beach from the cruise port and we had this ceremony it ended up being insanely beautiful these are some photos that the photographer got of the event and then also some iphone clips that one of the guests was able to get throughout the ceremony i didn't get any vlog footage just because I was the maid of honor and I wanted to be fully present with my parents on this really special day but overall I'm just so grateful that I got to be a part of this and I'm so grateful that all my family got to be there for my parents and it just was an amazing memory for all of us. So where are we currently Jay? On an ocean. Golf. Golf. Golf, yes. We have like a full sea day today. It's also New Year's Eve, which is very exciting. Last day of 2022. It's about like 9.30, right? Yeah. Where is it? 9.30. We just got ready for the day, showered, threw on our bathing suits, and might go get some food. We'll see. Trying to like make the most of our day because it's our first full sea day. Okay guys, we made it to breakfast and we're at the buffet. I got an omelet with tomato, pepper, onion, some bacon, and a hard-boiled egg. And we got a nice view of the ocean out there. Right, Cheers. Right. Cheers, everybody. I feel bad the better. So how do we leave you down? Cheers. Cheers. So the Celebrity Cruise Line has this app where they're listing all the activities they have for each day. And right now there's pool volleyball going on between the officers and guests. Not sure which side is officers. I'm guessing this side. Seems very intense. <laughs> okay, guys. It's around... What time is it? 1.30 and I met up with my family. We were just kind of up at the top pool deck. All of the chairs are basically taken today because it's a sea day and everyone had the same idea to go to the pool. But my mom's cousin reserved like six or seven chairs for us to sit at, which was nice. We sat there for a while. We're passing Cuba right now. At least that's what our captain told us. And we're traveling at 10 knots. Let me move my <laughs> beer bottle. This is, I think, the highest deck. Is this the highest deck? Yes. I think it is. Really cool little, like, green area. It seems like there's some type of reception going on over there. Okay, our family just sent us to get sandwiches for them <laughs> from this Ocean View Cafe. So, we're about to do that. Okay, we're in the buffet trying to smuggle some <laughs> sandwiches for my family. They wanted food, and no, I, since I we're the youngest, we're on the duty to do so. Success, everybody. <laughs> My brother wanted to show off his new um, retainer case. He lost, you lost yours like the first day, right? Yeah, I mean, I lost it this morning and I talked to the staff and they found it in a dirty yeah. coat that I wear. So this is a solution. <laughs> Just got lunch. Um, I've been eating super healthy on this trip, as you can see. Okay, Jay's really excited because <laughs> what are we doing? Trivia. Trivia, and he loves doing trivia. And we got front row seats for it too. We got here so early. How early is it? Doesn't start for another 20 minutes. I don't know if I'll be playing. I might be taking on more of a supportive role. <laughs> we'll see. But yeah, this is like the sky lounge of the ship, and they've been having like late night stuff here with like a DJ. It's really cool. Ascorbic acid is the scientific name of oh, God. vitamin uh, uh, A. This is already, this is already hard. <laughs> I feel like it's vitamin C. Sorry, that's, that's so loud. Yeah, vitamin C. Alright, we got 9 out of 20, correct? Better than nothing. The questions were kind of hard to be honest, but at least we got- Okay guys, we just got ready for dinner. We have reservations at 545. Basically how dinner works on the cruise is each person gets an assigned time for sit down dinner. So there's a 5.45 reservation and then an eight and we got the 5.45. And if we want, we could always do like the buffet, but the sit down one, you get pretty much a lot better food and you get an actual waiter. So yeah, we've been eating with my parents, my grandparents, my aunt, my brothers, and it's been nice, except we didn't do last night because the wedding lunch was huge and no one was really hungry, but we're walking over there now. We're a little bit late, but it's okay. <laughs> Is this still recording? Wait, no, it's recording. Okay.
Now give me a little pose. <laughs> Show off, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> okay, dinner looks super good. I got the lobster tail. Jay got the beef wellington. Okay, after dinner, and we just reserved what we're doing tomorrow. It is a off-roading adventure where we swim in a tavern. We were able to do it through the app. We were kind of scared because for a second it said it was sold out, but I think when we were looking at it, it like automatically reserved it for us. So excited to do this. We're out at the pool right now. They're like setting up for the big party out here. And the balloons say 2022, which we're a little confused about. I think someone maybe didn't understand the assignment. That's all you're gonna get. They gave me four. I said, that's four peanuts. She said, it's eight. Bring them in half. Stop bringing the bell. <laughs> Everybody, we made it to Mexico. We are meeting up with our excursion. We got our wristband. I think it's time to go. Apparently, we're driving. We just found that out. We're doing yeah. like an ATV, so yeah, it should be a fun day. The water is so blue by the port. That's our ship right there. The Norwegians in front of it, and then the celebrities right there. It's like crystal clear right now, which is really impressive because usually ports are really polluted. I'm falling to pieces in my room. Are you coming over? That's cool. We finished up at the Mayan sinkhole. It was very cool. The water was honestly not as cold as I was expecting and it's like 64 feet deep. People are checking out some bats that are over here and you can smell the sulfur. There's so much sulfur here. Oh my God. Okay, hi guys. The music here is really loud so I don't know how well you can hear us but we're eating lunch at this beach resort place that the tour company owns that has a bunch of pools and the water no, has a I bunch of my, my, my The water has a bunch of the water has a bunch of rafts in it that we're gonna go swim in, in a sec, but we have like 50 or 40 minutes here. We're just gonna chill, swim, because we haven't had much beach time, and then we have to go back to the ship. This is what the beach looks like. Then there's a pool over there. Okay, everybody, we made it back to the ship. I don't know if you can hear it, but it's starting to shake because we are about to leave Cosmo. But it was a super fun day. The tour ended up being a lot of fun. We just basically rode back to the ship after we went to the beach and swam for a bit. But now we're all ready for dinner and we're gonna go meet up with my family. You keep doing the thumbs up. Jay was like, it's a game to like take a shot every time he does a thumbs up in the video because he keeps doing that. That's two, so it, two more. But yeah, we're late to dinner, so we should probably go. The sun is starting to set right now. There she is. It's so pretty. See you later, Mexico. Actually, the, the staff here is they... Okay, guys, it is our last day of the cruise. Jay so wanted to show off his drink that he tried. What is it called? It's a French Caribbean. French Caribbean. Yeah, it's mango juice with uh, spice rum. I got a Aperol Spritz, even though it's not included in our classic drink package. The bartender made it for me, which is really nice. It is a sea day today, so we were doing what we were basically doing last sea day, which is hanging out with the family. I just talked to my grandpa for a while about semester at sea, so that was really nice. Got to show him like all my photos and stuff, but kind of more cloudy today, so it's a little bit less steamy. It was sprinkling for like two seconds there, but we're at like the top deck of this ship. My family's still by the pool, but they have like a nice little seating area over here. They have another bar over here. Pretty solid day so far. Alright, everybody. It is 
time to get ready for dinner. Most nights we've been, for some reason, having to rush getting ready for dinner, but we have like an hour to get ready, so that'll be nice to not have to like sprint to get dinner in time. I think it's just because our time, our seating for dinner is so early, we have to be there at like 5.45. I just got iced coffee, which I'm excited about. Last night, I was so tired that I literally fell asleep in the clothes I wore to dinner. I didn't even change into my PJs. So hopefully the coffee will keep me awake for tonight. There's supposed to be like another comedy show. I'm gonna go to that. And then my family has a group photo. My parents' wedding had like a whole photography package that came with it and I guess they have one more session left which they're gonna use for all my family members who came on the trip there's like 20 of us total so we'll do that after dinner and then Jay wants to go in the hot tub we have yet to go in the hot tub so maybe we'll be able to catch that before it closes I think it closes at like 10 but it's been a pretty solid day. I think I got some more freckles now that I'm looking at myself in the camera. Apparently our room is a lot bigger than the rooms at the back of the ship because our window is slanted. We have like all this extra space right here. <laughs> There's actually a good bit of machines in here and tables and we're drinking mojitos. Lower your bets so you can have more plays. This is the machine Brandon chose. 